One thing that you see this morning, one thing, if you would go ahead and put that up for me, please. One, read it out loud with me. Generosity is God's nature and the foundation of his kingdom operation. Say it again like you mean it. Generosity is God's nature and the foundation of his kingdom operation. We've already said it. God is generous. Everything he does, he has more than enough. He, he came. Jesus said, the thief comes to steal, kill, and destroy, but I've come that you might have life and have it what? More abundantly so that you have not just enough to meet the need, but more than enough so that you can abound in love. What is that saying? If you steward the seed and you can become generous instead of being greedy, you won't be hungry and everything around you will transform and change if you are faithful and disciplined to continue to steward the seed, living out of a lifestyle of generosity in the same way that the God you worship is, a God who is generous, generosity is the foundation of his kingdom operation, realizing that these laws, the law of love that motivates you, the law of reciprocity, it's an upside-down kingdom. Because we're here to demonstrate to the rest of the world, they're the ones that are really upside down. We've come to turn it right side up to show the world that you don't have to intimidate or manipulate, but you can serve somebody. And in that process, God will give you the ability to lead. Come on, somebody. You can, you can lay down your desires and die to something so that something greater can live. Jesus said, except a corn or a seed of wheat fall into the ground and die, it abides alone. But if it die it will produce much fruit. And so one seed dies in the ground and becomes a stalk that grows up and has at least three ears on it with three or four hundred seeds on every ear of corn. So one ear of corn, I'm sorry, one seed of corn, one kernel, will produce a thousand times what it started out as one. Multiplication. We do this out of love. That is our motivation. We do it out of realizing that we've got a kingdom where we have to demonstrate to the world, hey, look, this is the right side up. It's not dog eat dog, but it's living out of a life of generosity and helping others and sowing to reap and giving to receive and, and, and dying in order to live and serving in order to lead and realizing that every time I do, when I give, God gives back. When I forgive, God forgives back. This is what I want you to see this morning as I close this.